back to Huber. Huber loses it. Kept in by Mahalik. Tried to get it to Thompson, knocked out. Mann throws it to the near corner. Chased by Campbell. Along the near board, Campbell is decked. In the replay, we'll see uh, Huber standing there, and Stamler comes in behind him right about here. Huber gives him a stick a little bit, and there's the swipe. Although not in a dangerous spot, he hit him in the, in the rear end. Taken there by Campbell, McCourt with him. Campbell sweeps it along the airboard. Look who it's knocked down from behind by Corn. Corn comes up with a puck, gives it to McCourt. McCourt centering pass, and the puck is knocked away. Out it comes to center ice. Centering pass intended for Sullivan. He got a shot away, and then Sullivan gave him a little chop as they both went to the board. Ball bangs it off the boards, loose. Now very long goes after it. Glenn Hicks is decked from behind. They jam it up against the boards. We'll have a faceoff coming up. Here we go. There's big Willie Huber come firing in there. We can't really, there we see Polonix now really giving it to somebody. Huber had a hold of one of the players from behind, and Dennis was really throwing the right hand. There's big Huber, he's all over the place. I think Willie's been throwing his body around all night. He's ready for some action. He's got a real pile up over there. Out of the, out of the picture right now, we see, I think it's Campbell and Dennis Pliny. There they are just coming into the left side of your screen. And uh, Campbell, a good head taller than Polanyi, but boy, Dennis was really wailing on him. I looked like Sopcich was going to sort of ignore it, but uh, as you can plainly see, others did not. Well, you know, I, I, I'm afraid for the Red Wing point here, they may receive an extra two-minute penalty. And... Uh, here we see in the replay how this all started. Glenn Hicks, of course, was really hit from behind. Uh, I can't see who that was on the Winnipeg side, but Hicks took exception to that a little bit. And then, as you'll we'll see, here's Huber right about here. He decides to go in and take a run. And there's Campbell. And Huber goes in. And there goes Willie with the big left hand. He's really giving it to Campbell right there, and I think that's where Polani got into it. But uh, we could see an extra penalty for Detroit here. Uh, there's only 2 2 left in the hockey game. There's Mr. Campbell, and uh, oh, he's he's having it out with some of the fans down by the alleyway, but he's out of the game. That after the whistle sounded, that it was going to all end. Because Sobchak, uh, as you can see now, so here's the here's the charge by the Winnipeg player on Glenn Hicks, and he really knocked like him flying. Cameron that nailed him. It, yes, it is Cameron, and then Barry Long comes in, just tries to freeze it. Paul Woods is in there, and Polanyi is in. All four Red Wings in there, and then you'll see from the right side of your screen, Campbell right about. Here, there he is there. And then Huber, of course, watching him come in, went in and grabbed him and just started throwing punches. Him and Polanyi, I think, both both working Campbell over. And the hockey game is over. And the Red Wings record a 6-4 victory over the Winnipeg Jets. But it wasn't easy.